Hello, welcome to Tile Coach. I'm Isaac Ostrom, and today I'm standing in a shower. This is Disney's Grand Californian Hotel. And if you're like me, when you come to a new place, uh, you want to check out the tile work. And so that's what I do. Whenever I stay in a hotel, whenever I go to a restaurant, I look in the bathrooms. Uh, but especially when I'm in a hotel, I look at the showers and see how they did it, see how the quality is, and I just check them out. So. I'm letting you in on my world here as I'm at the hotel with my family. We've been fortunate enough to um, be staying here a couple days. This is our um, third or four, is it our, how many times, babe, have Three. we been here? This, so yeah, this is our third time uh, that we've stayed here and every time I've noticed the tile work. So Disney's Grand Californian Hotel is done in, in this like arts and crafts theme kind of like uh, Frank Lloyd Wright style, a lot of earth tones, um, exposed beams, a lot of these colors, and that's why they kind of went with this motif here. You can see they did an alternating uh, eight inch and four inch tile, and that really gives it that nice arts and crafts look, along with the earth tones in this stone and glass mosaic. This is actually a paper face mosaic, I really like it. It's got the different blends of stone and glass, and they just kind of plop these in uh, in the four-inch space. A little design feature there. Uh, the ceramic itself is it's not a handmade ceramic, but it's made to look like a handmade ceramic. It's not perfectly flat. It has some little undulations in it, and a beautiful grout job. To me, this looks like Customs Poly Blend grout. It has a really nice hard finish and they did a really good job on the grout job. Uh, on the floor, um, they have this marble mosaic. This is a basket weave pattern is what they call it, and this is the Crema Marfil marble. So one thing I hear from a lot of people is they don't want to use marble. And the reason they don't want to use marble is because they're afraid of the upkeep, they're afraid of staining or failures or something like that. And I think there's a lot of misinformation on that. Marble has been used in bathrooms for thousands of years. You can see this marble mosaic, and it's this is about four years old. Um, they did the refurbishment in 2017, in the end of 2017. And so this shower is over four years old. It's used daily, and so the, not only the floor, because the outside bathroom floor is the same mosaic, and it comes into this curbless entry shower, and the shower area that's getting wet every day. Uh, it looks great. It's, it's held up. It looks like it was installed just last month. And so um, this is a testament that marble um, can be used in bathrooms and it holds up great. Another thing I noticed is that they grouted in the changes of plane. Instead of using silicone or sealant, this is hard grout in the corners. There's no cracking. There's no discoloration. There's no flaking. And I know TCNA says to, to use uh, flexible caulking and all the changes of plane, that's the floor wall transition and the inside corners here. But you can see grout looks much better, especially when they do a good job. They clean their corners, they, you know, they use, uh, must use their margin trowel to clean up the corners because it's a nice tight 90 degree. It's not rounded in the corners where somebody rushed it. Um, a lot of commercial work you see that where they just, you know, slop up the grout and don't clean it nice but whoever installed this tile did a really good job they cut in really nicely up to the ceiling scribed to the ceiling again all of their trim pieces are installed really well nice and flat and it's just a great tile job one thing that bugs me a little bit too when you go to a hotel is when they don't give you like good shampoo and body wash and that's one thing that disney does really well it's they they hook you up with some like high quality body wash and shampoos. It smells good. I mean, it's, it does, those little extras really make a difference. So all in all, this is just a really nice, beautiful shower and I was impressed with it. So I wanted to share it with you. If you're in another part of our country, or another part of the world, I'm glad you got to be here and experience some of our tile work and hopefully you get to come see it for yourself. Come visit us, come on over and check it out. So I'm glad you're here with us, and last but not least, I love you. I love being your tile coach, and we'll see you on the next video.